So hey guys, I'm gonna show you my improved version of the Antwenom's design of the combination lock. So, and some other things as well. So this is the memory result that Antwenom showed in his video at the start. It's a very simple one. Works like this. It's very simple. This is his design. Works like this. This is my my design, which somebody probably had come up before me, but this is what I came up with a long time ago. So it works like this. Uh, I get it. Yeah. So there, these two are practically the same thing, but this is more compact way. And this is what I came up with just a couple days ago and I probably think somebody has talked about this uh, before me too so it works like this this is probably the com most compact way you can do it is vertically so yeah this is my first my first design of the improved version so it works it works pretty much like the Antwenos but there's this thing if you have two like this like in the right order but when you push wrong it will restart the whole thing that's the point of this design it restarts and plus when you get all right You don't really need a enter button because oh shit enter button because if you can't really get it wrong if you get it right like yeah you get I think you get what I mean I'll explain it later but yeah and this there is a switch which works at all this is better version of that this works just like that this version but it's more compact like this in here I've got to dig around a little bit two blocks high or down and it's more compact it, I don't need to dig, dig here or something and it's more one block lower than that is so it's much more compact and this has the same thing as that if you push this and then wrong it will turn off so yeah so this is the first from my first design it uses this and I will put this here so this is the one my code 3 8 6 5 1 2 4 7 oh that's it no well now you see it restarted the whole thing when I put it wrong. Yeah, so 3, 8, 6, 5, 1, 2, 4, 7, 9. And it opens the door. And now I just want to close the door and let's push the reset. Pull it close. So yeah. And plus, oh well, I'm gonna show it later. But yeah, this is this is actually the Antwenom's design here, this part here. And I'll show you how it works. I'm just push the buttons like this, and like this. And when you push the Enter Reset button, it will open the door, and you have to reset the whole thing from the tight closed or close the door from here yeah. this is with my design it works exactly the same like this but uh, yeah exactly like that but it's more compact this don't have the reset if you push the wrong button if you can see like this because this it's actually just, just this but in a more compact way so yeah and other thing I want to show you on this design is 
when you do this you can actually shield like that and they all go on but with my design you can do that like it will actually turn off when you play do this so that's good and we have to use this wait Okay, not yours. So, bug or something. So yeah, then there's one bad, a couple of bad things in this. First of all, if you push wrong button, it doesn't reset. It, so you can actually just tap this all like many times, and you get it right at some point. And push that just the end will open door. And when the door is open, you actually have to push a different button to close it with my design you just push the right buttons it will open open the door and then you just push the reset and it will reset the whole thing and close door so yeah that's I think that's all about the one oh yeah this oh, the, you can actually easily cover all this with that so it much compact so you can like cut from here and take this part off and just put this in, <laughs> yeah, in the reply replace this thing here and it works just like the same so yeah I forgot that you can't you don't need those repeaters behind this wall you can do it actually without them like this lower the middle low torch goes here right torch goes like normally and left too and the middle left goes the side and right too and the center goes just normally and top left and right goes normally to forward and with the top middle you just put it a block above it and it will go through this there. so you don't really need and one thing why the hell for do you want to do this like this you don't need these things here it's complete waste of time and redstone and yeah Diamond redstone. Okay, sorry about that. That's... Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You can do it actually like this too. See, one repair there and it works just like the same thing. And you don't need to store just like doing some delay on it to design I don't think you need these things yeah that was the point so see ya